tell me how. It's May. And look at all that snow. It's almost June. It doesn't make sense. Denver, Colorado, it doesn't make sense. <laughs> it's so wild. So first of all, good morning. Good morning to you, good morning. This is my current physique. It's really hard to see me in this lighting. Let me show you over here. I really want you guys to see what the physique is. So you can really get a picture. Yeah, so this is my current physique. I'm actually on my way to Los Angeles. So, yeah, I'm pretty, I'm feeling pretty good. Really, really lean as you can see. And me competing, I can't wait to see where I get. Let's get it, body weight to bodybuilding. So I'm currently on my way to LA. I have my meal right here, as you can see. Half a cup of white rice, about nine ounces of salmon, and eight ounces of broccoli. I make it a priority to get my meals in no matter what. So while I'm on the train to the airport, I'll get a meal, and then once I land, Next and I'm there, and I'm settled, I'll get another meal. Do what it takes. Don't make excuses. We fell in love as the leaves turn brown, and we could be together, baby, as long as skies are blue. I've officially landed here in Los Angeles, my old home. Super excited to be here. I haven't even eaten today, really. I had that one meal very early in the morning um, and on my way to the train. It's like 12.35 now. It's really 1.35 in Denver. So I'm gonna eat a meal. I'm gonna make sure I'm getting my macros in. We're gonna get a leg workout in today, which means my calories are all up to like 3,200, whatever. When I step on stage, I'm telling you right now, I'm coming with a package. I don't even know what that means, but it sounds juicy. And it sounds like I'm bodybuilding. So creatine HCL, let's ride. <laughs> All right, you can barely hear me. I forgot to freaking bring the camera when I was eating. So, these are my macros. This is what I just ate. Can you see it? Yeah, kinda. This, yeah, okay. This is what I ate right here. So, with me, because I didn't have my meals, because I didn't like, I, I had to figure it out, I went into Whole Foods and I just figured it out. Instead of getting the hot bar, instead of getting all this extra shit, I don't need it. I don't need it. I got some calorie restricted food. I don't know what that means. It sounded good. So what we're gonna do now, we're gonna clean up, probably eat one more meal, and jump right into the workout. It's leg day, baby. Which means 3,280 calories is what I'm consuming today. Let's get it. We are here at No Limit Training Facility. Look at the No Limit sign. Look at that. Ooh. Sexy. Ooh. So what we're gonna be doing is uh, jumping into legs. Uh, this is one of the coolest gyms in LA. If you have not been here before, you definitely should come. Volume, volume's key. I'm exhausted, it's been a long, long day. There's been a lot of things happening, but uh, you gotta get it in, no matter what. No excuses, eat right. If you eat right, you feel right. If you feel right, you look right. Let's get it. Quick warm up. Always warm up before your training. I'm telling you, it will save you, it will save your body long term. So I'm here on the Stairmaster, as you can see. I'm gonna go up to about like, I don't know, level 10 for about five minutes. And I'm gonna roll out and I'm gonna do a couple other movements and jump right in. Let's have a good workout. All right, set number one. Actually, it's gonna be a super set. So we're gonna be doing some hack squats uh, into lunges. So we're gonna do 10 to eight. 
It's gonna be intense, we're gonna hit four sets, but we're going close with that hack squat. Let's get it. Here we go. Single leg. We're gonna be doing, actually, you know what, fuck it. We're gonna do double leg. Sorry for my language, but not really. <laughs> double leg, then we're moving over to GHR. Blast those hammies and those glutes. The glutes and the low back are gonna be working like crazy on the GHRs. If you have a machine like that, do it. If not, put your feet under something and get to it. That's it, baby. As you can see, it's like 9 p.m. tonight. I'm generally liking to work out around 7 a.m., but switching it up now that I'm not in altitude. The altitude difference, did you notice the difference in my workout? Oh yeah. How like, I have more energy, I have a little bit more oxygen. It's because of the altitude difference from Denver, Colorado to LA. But this is where I'm at, man. I don't really know how to, is this pretty good? Yeah, it's all. I don't really know how to, how to do the whole shebang. 
but I'll definitely get there. I'm getting leaner, absolutely. So what the hell? Anyways, thanks for tuning in for this episode of Bodyweight to Bodybuilding. I'm stepping on stage, baby. I'm stepping on stage, yeah. And you're gonna join me, yeah? I wanna show you what's possible. Going from 163 pounds, losing everything, like literally everything. My ability to walk, my ability to fucking hold my bladder because I was pissing all the time, headaches, sickness, sinus surgery, addicted to pain pills, antibiotics, all this nasty shit, torn shoulder in four places, complications to stem cell surgery, complications to sinus surgery. What's possible is way outside of the scope of right here. It's way outside of your means. And if you keep on hustling and you keep on focusing on the prize and what you want, everything else will come to fruition. Thanks for tuning in for another episode of Bodyweight to Bodybuilding. Subscribe if you haven't already. Check out the podcast in the description. And I'll see you next time. Peace.